Hello, my name is Jennifer and welcome to part 31 of house 6 of the Drifter Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And at the end of the last part, we aged up George, so he is now a child. So I have him in Create a Sim where I have given him, I guess, a little bit of a makeover. I changed his hair, I gave him some new clothes. So here is his new look. And it is fall going to the winter, if I remember correctly. So I gave him sort of warmer clothes. <laughs> The clothes you wear when it's cold outside. So here is his first outfit, and yes, he is a little spellcaster, which we already knew. So he's gonna be dancing around. Uh, there is his second one, which is just you know it is there, and there is his third everyday outfit. Here is his formal outfit, which is pretty formal, but I don't know that you'll see it again because I don't find they tend to wear them very much. Here is his athletic. Also an outfit I don't tend to see on my sim kids very much. His sleep ones, I'm sure you'll see because, you know, he'll need to sleep. And there he has three of those for that reason. And now his party wear, I completely got rid of what he had on in his party wear. So there is his first one, kind of casual. And then another, still somewhat casual. Probably not quite as casual as the first one, swimwear. Just one suit, just in case it's warm enough when they go over to Oasis Springs Park. Hot weather, again, he needs that in case we go over to Oasis Springs car Park and it is hot. It is may not be hot. It just won't, shouldn't be as cold as it is in their own world. And then, of course, for cold weather, he has a bunch. So here is his first one, which is reasonable to wear inside. A second one, also reasonable to wear inside. A third one, clear the categories. <laughs> Definitely reasonable to wear inside. And here is his actual true outdoor clothes. But I didn't bother giving his gloves. Giving him gloves or hats, I don't tend to do that very much. So there he is as a child. So I'm going to go back to live mode and I will be back. So we're back in live mode and the party is over. But what I want to do is I want to have Fleur talk up George to Florence because of the fact that let me just let me get in here and friendly other sims talk up another sim and we'll go to household and we want to do a George just so that he has another child as a friend and he probably won't be able to make friends with him because he is not or with her because George is not a celebrity and we've already done that with Emmeline and Edward I don't know where you're running but I guess it doesn't really matter but hopefully we can get this done and uh, then everybody's gonna say goodbye but he may say goodbye we can always invite her over another time. So it looks like Emmeline is coming and talking to George. So we can discuss favorite art pieces maybe. And talk about the windy weather. And ask her about her inspiration. I'm just looking. So she is friend and grandmother. And he's getting really tired. So we're going to have to switch off his... Um, did, you know, he can't attempt it. Did you actually do what I asked you to do? Oh, you're reading. You're putting Gideon to bed. Can we try this again? I guess, oh, well, we can always invite her over another time if this doesn't work. But we'll try one more time and see if it works. If not, that's fine. He did have shorter hair when he aged up, but because he had sort of that little bowl cut as a toddler, I wanted to give him something a little longer, and so this was nothing. There's nothing that looks similar to what he had, but that was the closest thing I could come up with. Oh, he's in his... Well, your bed is over there, Gideon. Hmm. I don't really want to dump you out of your bed, but, you know, that was where you were supposed to be sleeping. Hmm. Uh, because this is where your brother's bed is supposed to go. Sorry to tell you. And does this fit over here? Not right now. C can it fit if we move this one notch that way? Yes, it does. It does fit there. So, yeah, I just kind of want to put like a double bed because I prefer double beds because of the fact that they are less likely to... Actually, we're going to just stick that into our household inventory. And I'm sorry, sweetie, but that's going away. You need to actually go sleep in your own bed and not in here. So do we have 
a bed already. We do, but you know, it's not very high stats on this bed. It is only, oh, it doesn't even tell me. It doesn't tell you here because we own it. So it doesn't give you the details. Let me go into uh, the regular, not our inventory. And we're going to go into comfort and look at the beds. And it was a pretty good stats for an inexpensive bed because it was energy five and etc. But compared to like this one is six, six, and we have something better. I know this is, that's a good nine, eight. I think that's the same bed that, yeah, <laughs> that his sister has. And then this is nine. Uh, we have enough money. We'll just get, I know they need to save a little bit more money to get the house that I have built. And I have decided that I'm going to just use it and I'll just adjust it to make it more suitable to Willow Creek. Um, and I've already started doing that. So maybe we'll just see what colors this comes in. We'll give him a blue one of this. <laughs> make sure it's not the same color. Uh, why is this not fitting? Okay. We don't really need... Maybe we'll put this over here. And we don't need a potty in here anymore. We can just grab an extra potty. And we do have two toddlers still because we have the twins. So, oh, I know probably what it was. It was probably this, not this, this. We'll move it down once we have the bed. So let's get back to trying this bed. We'll put it here and I'll change. I don't think that was, I don't know if that was the color. That was the color I chose. Okay. And then we'll take this and we will put it down and we'll change the color. Kind of looks more a bit green to me, but oh well. So there is his bed. And actually while we're here, I'm going to get a rocking chair because uh, Nifty Knitting is out. And maybe we'll get one that's a little cozy. And is there anything that's going to, there's got a red. That's got some red. So we'll put it here. There we go. Hopefully that doesn't block anything. We shall see if it does, you know, it does. So you may as well come and actually read him to sleep in his own room. And now forget that. I have my reasons. I know you want to go to sleep, but you are going to come read Gideon to sleep and then you can go to sleep in your room. And you're very tense. Uh, yelled at by coworker. Oh, well. Hail pass. So we're going to go back to this. We're going to have, you are going to assign, we're going to assign this bed to you. And then I want your mom to give you a second win so that you can keep going a little bit better. So we're going to parenting. If we can, we can give a second wind. So there we go. We'll do that. And are you tired? You're kind of tired, but you're not as tired. But it's late now, so you're going to go to bed in your room. And hopefully we don't get a whole bunch of stuck kids people here like we did last time. Oh, look, they can get in that room. No problem. The rocking chair is not in the way. So good. So now that you've had your second wind, you it actually really did a lot for you. But you're going to just go to bed. And... Hmm, maybe what I will do is I will just take these potties and put them here and get a sink for this bathroom because he's in here. Though I'd rather almost have a change this bathtub to a shower bath combo because I'd rather him shower and then it'd be better to be on this side that way. But let's get the sink to start with and we will get, we'll get this one. I don't know which one I had. And then we're going to just put that in our inventory because we may need it later. And then we will just get one of these bathtubs. We'll just get this one. That's cute. So there we go. So there we have our shower and everything. So that's something close to him that he can shower in. But we can still bathe the toddlers in. So is she, she is confident. And she has to go to the bathroom. Okay. So she, 
You know, you're in our rocking chair, Emmeline. But we can't really use it anyways. Well, we can. <laughs> but I was thinking, going back, I need to get some knitting baskets. That's what I need to do. <laughs> um, I got the chair and I forgot the knitting baskets. So let's go into activities and skills and creative. And we'll just get, we'll get this one for four Fleur, and then we'll get these ones for the kids. We'll get this one for um, Gabrielle, and then we'll get that one for George there, because they can uh, learn the skill. And she's not really getting anywhere with that, because we're not having a party right now, so there's no point working on that. And it was just to get a few points for it, whatever. And we'll put her on to Lady of the Knits. And is she, has she quit her job yet? No, she hasn't, but she works in a few days and she does have five vacation days. And she's actually a little hungry. So we should probably take her and let her grab a serving. And we'll just put that in the fridge. And you don't need cake. You are a bit hungry. You're probably better to come eat some of this breakfast scramble yourself. And then you should come and watch the cooking channel. You can watch culinary training videos to get your fun up while you're eating and before you go to bed. And right, he did his first term. Let's see, when is his classes? He has a class in 11 hours and he doesn't, hasn't done his homework. Uh, at least he only has that one that he has to do, and he works in four days. So at least he doesn't work for very long. And I think I already gave him a needs, he used the needs potion already. He may have to use her needs potion, because <laughs> I'm not sure how good she is at magic. So I don't like, can she even do a, try and do, brew a potion yeah, she doesn't. She needs an apple. Well, that shouldn't be that hard to do. We've got some stuff out here. Do we not have an apple tree? Oh, it's winter now. So if we had an apple tree, that's a grow fruit tree, a grow fruit tree. And this is an apple tree and it's out of season. So we're going to take it and move it to be sheltered. And what is this tree? It's a lemon tree. I'm surprised it's like this. I wonder when we planted it. I guess we just planted it, I'm guessing. So why don't you come out here and harvest... I can say harvest all, but maybe you should just supercell. Just... Oh, we have some other plants that are out of season that I wasn't paying attention to. So we are going to grab them and put them in here. I'm assuming, I'm not sure why that's wild. I know it's because we harvested, but normally once you plant them, they're not wild anymore. I think I remember seeing that as a report on EA Answer Headquarters. And those should be in season, so they're fine. That's in season. This is out of season, so we'll put it in, in here and keep it here and I'm probably just I can't be bothered I'll probably keep most of the stuff just in unless I know it doesn't go out of season like the ones that are out there never they don't have seasons so they're fine outside so now that we've done that let's have her come and sell all she what what level are you anyways of this skill you are just come sell all gardening you're a bit you're quite a bit away actually and I don't really want to ask for gardening tips right now because I don't really want you to get focused and your your host masterpiece is almost over and what are your you need to go to the bathroom I guess I never got you the steel bladder trait I'm just making sure I didn't actually get it for her versus it not working properly so there you're going to go here and you are really tired. 
So go have a sleep. And hopefully I'll pay attention. I'll let you sleep a bit. Then I'll get you up to do your homework. And then you can go back to sleep. So she's, we're selling all of those. You want to start a club gathering. Well, <laughs> I don't know if I pinned that or not. But hopefully the good quality bed will help him get a good sleep. And not have to sleep very long. So she is still selling. Let's go fast. While she sells everything in the garden, we can watch her selling in the garden. Did you sell this already? Nope. So we're going to get a lot of money. Okay. Bye-bye. Thanks for hanging out. Okay. This is going too slow. Like it was like froze there for a bit. So we're going to keep, uh, <laughs> I probably should have started with the money tree, which is more worth a lot more. She really is doing quite, doing this quite slowly. Okay. I'm going to cancel this and um sell all here hopefully she gets back in time so she's gonna go to the bathroom i'll be back when she's selling and she's back she there's a twenty-two thousand from that tree did it become perfect it did and it is still green some of my neighborhoods flip flop between green and neutral they don't stay <laughs> green and i mean there's an advantage to being green but there's also the fact that it makes it hard to be able to evolve plants because they already evolve. So we're going to stargaze and get her inspired and also help her fun a little bit. And then we're going to go do some knitting. Hopefully, well, I was going to say on the rocking chair, but the nanny seems to really like the rocking chair. Which uh, <laughs> isn't very helpful when we want to knit in it. And we can put this here. And, okay, well, we'll just knit here. We'll knit some beanies. We'll knit a orange tiger beanie. That sounds like fun. Really, I want her to get, unlock. <laughs> uh, oh, no. And I was thinking, I'm used to playing where I have club gatherings going at home. But, of course, you can't do that in. With Drifter, you can only have club gatherings going off your lot. So I was like, oh, I should add knitting as a club activity. Or not a club activity per se, but as a um, perk for doing. But I, I don't need to add it as a club activity. I find a lot of my Sims will just autonomously knit. Though sometimes they get bored and they don't want to knit anymore. So that may happen. But uh, yeah, they'll just like randomly start projects left, right, and center. If you have the knitting basket in their inventory, though obvious workaround is just to grab the knitting basket out of their inventory and then they don't do that. Have you slept enough? Oh my goodness. I guess it's almost this time to get up. So why don't you come use that and take a shower? And of course, Fleur doesn't have to sleep anymore because we were able to get her the trait where she doesn't sleep. The uh, never weary trait. I probably should get her the the doesn't need to sleep. Doesn't need to use the bathroom trait too. Hope oh, she's level two. The other thing I could get her, I'll have to decide. I could get her savant, which you're supposed to gain skills more quickly. And then later get her the um, steel bladder trait. That's what I'm going to do. And hopefully it actually works. <laughs> so we'll see if she seems to level up quicker now that... Well, she also, it is morning, so she does have the morning sim. So that should be boosting her already. And can she listen? Why don't we change the station to... I was going to say to metal, but I don't know. We, you do have to do that. So let's just try and knit another outfit. We can knit some socks this time. Why don't we knit some raccoon socks? We'll do gray, gray raccoon socks. And you're hungry, sweetheart. And you also need to go to the bathroom. So why don't you go to the bathroom? And then is this still good? We can try and grab a serving for yourself. Before you have to go to school. Oh my goodness, I totally forgot about him. When is his class? Four hours. So let's get get you up. And let me look and see what you actually need to do. You need to do network security. 
So do your homework for applied network security. Up you get. <laughs> up, up, up. Time to do your homework. It's very important because I let you oversleep. I completely forgot. And Gabrielle will put this in your inventory. Knitting helps a little bit with their emotional control. So, and I think the kids even, okay, you're just standing there. Why are you standing there? I hope you looked after. You, you're just not eating. I just quickly checked to make sure that I didn't have autonomy off, and I didn't. <laughs> but I was kind of like, why are you just standing around and not looking after yourself? Maybe he had just finished his shower, and that was why. You can try having those pancakes. And you know what? You can watch TV because you need some fun. Hopefully you can do both. Oh, and she's got to level three of knitting. Okay, are you doing your homework? You're standing around doing your homework. It would be kind of good if you went to the bathroom. Don't talk. Just do your homework. <laughs> Sorry, Felix. You really need to get your homework done before your class. And, and chatting with people is just going to make it take longer. Though you do have some time. Because your class is at 11 and it is only 8 a.m. in the morning. So that's good. So we should check in on the kids. The toddlers. Who have to go to the bathroom. They need to eat. Oh, he's really hungry. So let's see. We're going to give you a soybean and a carrot. And you're going to wake up. Uh, you may need to have a nap later. But you need to have something to eat now. And do you have school today? You do have school today. We'll just wait for your... We'll, you can be if you... Well, we're not going to... We're not going to let you be late. Because... Eight is when they're supposed to go, but nine is sort of the cutoff. I find that if they don't get there before nine, then they sort of get a penalty for not being there on time. So, but of course, because they're talking and doing other things, they're a little bit slower about eating. But luckily, Felix seems to be doing okay with his. So we can let him go to the bathroom when he's finished with that. And, and then... You should try and scrubber -roo yourself. And she got another one done. We'll scrubber -roo yourself if we can. And we'll see whether you have time for fun. <laughs> you may not. Okay, I'm not paying attention. She is putting her dish down and going to school. You need to stop watching TV now and go to school. There you go. Bye-bye. Have a good day. And you may as well clean up. And what are your needs like? You need to go potty. Can you go potty? You can go potty. And you need to go potty. Oh, now you're getting hungry. You weren't, oh, and you're using your diaper. In case you need to learn your potty skill. I don't like it when you use your potty. You're only level one, so that actually does make some sense. Can you say go potty? Did I make you both independent? I didn't remember making you both independent. <laughs> I thought I would made one inquisitive. Oh, I did. He must just have the high enough skill. So, okay. So we got that. And the nannies, I should have, the nanny was out of there. Okay. Have you got your school? You did your homework. You need some fun. Why don't you watch culinary training videos for a bit? Why don't you... Um, invite him to dance so that we can get him off the chair, hopefully. <laughs> and then we can use it. <laughs> Good. So now we're going to try and sneak in here and knit some more... What is an object that we can knit? I see knitting objects. We can knit a plant hanger. So we'll do that. We'll knit... Oh, good. She's level two of potty. We'll knit a short t cream... That's what we'll do. We'll do a cream one. <laughs> we managed to get them off, which is what we needed. And you have, your fun is going up and you do have some time before you go to class. You have two hours. Because we don't live on campus, we can go right at the, at the allotted time versus having to go an hour early. But we're going to leave this part here. Thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye. This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you like the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge let's plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, 
please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much.